Hello, fellow Reaper users. Uh, just saw a quick little trick today, um, something about Reaper that I didn't know before and I thought I'd share. Um, so I, I do a lot of MIDI stuff uh, these days, and um, I'm sure some of you do too. And a situation I will frequently encounter is you'll have something like this, where you got a whole bunch of notes and you want to create a smooth um, acceleration in the velocity. So generally, if you just left click and drag across, you can get this sort of thing. Um, but then when you listen back through it, uh, maybe the whole thing is not the way you want, or maybe as you're going across, you have some like hiccup type thing or something like that. And it's, it's just not as smooth as you want. Um, so what you can do is hold uh, shift and control and then left click and drag and then it'll automatically move them around as you click between them. So once again, that's going to be uh, control and shift, left click, drag, and you can adjust. Now, let's say um, we have something like a mod wheel and we have this sort of thing going on too. Same thing. There you go. So if you've done some uh, mod wheel thing and it's uh, not, not how you want it, you know, or, you know, like even more importantly, you get this sort of thing where it's really precise and you're trying to clean up part of it and then you like end up doing this weird thing where it's never quite right. You know, just uh, shift, control, left click, drag across, and it's pretty much how you want it. If uh, you get some problem there, just erase some of it. Control, shift, click, bam, done. All right, guys, keep using Reaper. Keep Reaper metal, keep the world metal, all that.